Good day, future licensed professional teachers. Tatalakayan natin ngayon ang mga topics ng social science with some questions on economics, world history, types of law, research, and more. 50 questions pa rin tayo and some answers will be rationalized. Okay, so let's begin. We have the four types of law, the eternal law. It contains the law that governs the universe. Second, divine law. This is the law of God revealed to people through the Bible. And third is the natural law. It states that people must do good and avoid evil. And the fourth law is the human law. This is promulgated by persons, uh, the everyday rules that govern our lives. Okay? Question number one. The Philippines' 10-year transaction period before the granting of complete independence from the Americans. Is it A, Commonwealth Government, B, Third Republic, C, Puppet Government, D, Revolutionary? The answer is letter A, Commonwealth Government. Okay, so the Commonwealth of the Philippines was the administrative body that governed the Philippines from 1935 to 1946, so roughly 10 years. Number two, the act or law that led to the granting of 10 year transition period. Okay, is it A, Harry House Cutting Bill, B, Tidings McJoffey Law? C. Parity Rights D. Independence Law The answer is letter B. Tidings McToffey Law Okay, this is also called the Philippine Commonwealth and Independence Act. Number three, the term that refers to the class of people of Filipinos who were free and independent. A. Timawa B. Maharlika C. Aliping Namamahay D. Aliping Sagigilid. Ang sagot ay letter A. Timawa. Okay? So, Timawa also known as free man. They were, um, they were free and they can acquire property. Uh, they can acquire any job they want and they can pick their own wives and can acquire an Alipin. Okay? The answer is letter A. Timawa. Number four, after World War II, which country was occupied and administered by the United States with the emperor assuming a primarily symbolic role as the head of the monarchical state? A. Cambodia B. Japan C. Thailand D. Korea The answer is letter B. Japan. Okay, so after the defeat of Japan in World War II, the United States led the Allies in the occupation and rehabilitation of the Japanese state. Number five, a system of social organization frequently associated with India, which is characterized by limited mobility and rigid structure. A. Sati. B. Brahmin. C. Caste. D. Sodras. The answer is caste. Okay? So, caste is a social hierarchy passed down through families. It dictates the professions a person can work in and as well as aspects of their social lives. Okay? It is caste and it is often associated in with the Indian. Okay? Number six, for official communication with their subjects in Mesopotamia and Syria, the Persians use blank, later adopting this as their own language. Okay, is it A, Aramaic, B, Cuneiform, C, Greek, and D, Persian? The answer is letter A. Aramaic, okay? It is um, a Northwest Sem Semitic language, okay? Originated among the Aramians in the ancient region of Syria, then quickly spread to Mesopotamia. Number seven, 
Which of the following demonstrates divergent questioning used by teacher Carla in her history class? A. Take note of the, the word divergent questioning. Okay. A. Who were the other founders of the Katipunan other than Andres Bonifacio? B. Between Rizal and Bonifacio, who is more deserving to be our national hero? C. During the Philippine independence celebration in Kawet Cavite, which band played the national anthem? D. How was Gregorio del Pilar killed the tiered bus? Okay, the answer is letter B. Okay, yung hinahanap is divergent questioning. Alamin natin ano tong divergent questioning. This type of questioning begins with a prompt and requires students to think creatively and critically to identify multiple potential answers. Okay? Uh, you allow your students to think critically. Okay? Number seven. Uh, number eight. Who was the one supreme god of the Persians? Zoro Zoroastrian religion who was believed to be the creator of all life and the god of light and truth a jesus b jehovah c ahara mazda d isis ang sagot dito ay letter c ahara mazda okay ahara mazda is the god of zoroastrianism okay from ancient persia now Iran, okay? Um, he was considered as the one true God. Number nine, which problem of resources fall under the task of economic allocation? Okay, problem of resources. A, quality. B, scarcity. C, standards. D, excellence. The answer is scarcity. Okay, scarcity is always associated with economics. Number 10. Non-economic wants and needs revolve around the issue of blank. A. Job underemployment. B. High prices of commodities. C. Women's role in the society. And D. Lowered family income. Now, take note of the A, B, and D. D, okay, they are economic wants and needs, except letter C, which is the women's role in the society. The question is the non-economic wants. Ang sagot natin dito ay letter C, women's role in the society. Number 11. Few land holdings and millions of peasant farmers characterize the Hispanic agricultural economy, a situation described as blank in land ownership. A. Monism. B. Monopolism. C. Dualism. And D. Altruism. Ang sagot ay letter C. Dualism. Number 12. There are non-conventional sources of energy that can be harnessed to, soft, to soften adverse consequences on the economy, but the blank is not one of them. Okay. A. Wind turbines. B. Geothermal. C. Fossil fuel. D. Solar panels. Ang sagot dito ay letter C. Fossil fuel. 13. Adam Smith believed that the desire of business people to earn a profit, when regulated by competition, would produce what consumers want. Hence, government should not interfere. Smith's philosophy is known as blank. A. Democratic Socialism. B. Socialism. C. Lies is fair. D. Modified Free Enterprise. Ang sagot dito ay letter C, laissez-faire. Okay, so this theory of Adam Smith advocates government non-intervention. Number 14, an action taken by central bank to influence the money supply and stabilize the economy is called blank. A, stabilization policy. 
B. Interest Rules Policy C. Fiscal Economy D. Monetary Policy Ang sagot ay letter D. Monetary Policy Monetary Policy, this is a set of tools used by the nation's central bank to control the overall supply of money and promote economic stability. Number 15, who is known in history as the greatest king who conquered for Persia? In 550 BC, the Median Empire, Lydia, Babylonia, and subject state. A. Cyrus. B. Darius. C. Sources. D. Philip. Ang tamang sagot ay letter A. Cyrus. 16. Hammurabi, the greatest of early kings who published a great code of law, belonged to the blank empire. A. Persian. B. Egyptian. C. Babylonian. D. Assyrian. Ang sagot ay Babylonian. 17. A series of religious wars between Christians and Muslims started primarily to secure control of holy sites considered sacred by both groups. A. Holy Wars B. War of Roses C. Crusade D. Panic Wars Ang sagot ay letter C. Crusade 18. Known as Virgin Queen who gave England's most prosperous years in wealth and culture was Blanc. A. Queen Victoria. B. Queen Elizabeth II. C. Queen Elizabeth I. And D. Queen Marie Antoinette. Ang sagot dito ay letter C. Queen Elizabeth I. Okay? Uh, Queen Elizabeth's the first rule was characterized by age of prosperity, okay? When the queen greatly contributed to the well-being of the nation's economy, okay? She was considered virgin queen because she had no children. Therefore, no direct heir to her throne. So, she was the last Tudor monarch, Queen Elizabeth I. 19. The fearless head of the Huns from Mongolia, who became the king of Hungary, was blank. A. Genghis Khan. B. Attila. C. Kublai Khan. And D. Odysseur. Ang sagot dito ay letter B. Attila. 20. Criticism on the past administration in Malaysia was its being blank, such as in suppressing the press. Is it A. Lizer Fair, B. Autocratic, C. Fascistic, and D. Authoritarian? Ang tamang sagot ay letter D. Authoritarian. Number 20. 21. Singapore is a de facto blank state with lack of separation of powers between the executive branch and the courts. Is it A. Alliance, B. One Party, C. Multi-Party, and D. Coalition? Ang sagot ay letter B. One Party. So, Singapore has been described as being a de facto one party state. 22. The collapse of the world's economy in 1930 is referred to as A. Black economy B. Bubonic plaque C. Great Depression D. Great Recession The answer is letter C. Great Depression Okay, so the time of Great Depression was a devastating and prolonged economic collapse in 1930. 23. The ziggurat towers of the Sumerians were used for blank A. Palace, 
B. Military post C. Worship D. Watchtower Ang tamang sagot ay letter C. Worship Okay, number 23, worship. Okay, so the great ziggurat was built as a place of worship dedicated to the moon god Nana in the Sumerian city of in ancient Mesopotamia. 24, recognized as the author of the American Declaration of Independence was blank A. Thomas Jefferson B. Abraham Lincoln, C. Benjamin Franklin, and D. Thomas Paine. Okay, ang tamang sagot dito ay letter A. Okay, Thomas Jefferson. So, the Declaration of Independence on July 4, 1776 was credited to Thomas Jefferson. He was the principal author of the Declaration. 25. Among the great teachers and philosophers of the Chao dynasty, Blank wrote the Tao Te Ching. A. Mencius, B. Confucius, C. Lao Tzu, D. Cho and La. Okay, the answer is letter C. Lao Tzu. Okay, so um, although Lao Tzu was dressed as a farmer, the border official recognized him and asked him to write down his wisdom. According to this legend, what Lao Tzu wrote became the sacred text called the Tao Te Ching. 26. Among English kings, Blank broke off with the Roman Catholic Church in 1534 and established himself as the head of the Church of England. Okay. A. King Richard the Great. B. King James the First. C. King Charles the First. And D. King Henry the Eighth. The answer is letter D. King Henry the Eighth. Okay. So this king, the supreme head of the Church of England, he formally broke with the Pope and the Roman Church. After Pope Clement the Seventh refused to him an annulment of his marriage to Catherine of Aragon, so that he could wed Anne. Twenty-seven, who was the son of Philip of Macedonia, who led his powerful army for successful conquest across Persia, up to the western border of India. A. Alexander the Great. B. Charles Martel, C. Ivan the Great, and D. Cyrus the Great. The answer is letter A. Alexander the Great. 28. Asia is said to be the cradle of civilization, while the blank is said to be the birthplace of the human species. A. Australia, B. Africa, C. South America, and D. Antarctica. The answer is letter B, Africa. So, Asia is said to be the cradle of civilization, and Africa is the birthplace of the human species. 29. Despite many successful reforms, <coughs> President Obama was described as a lame duck president because of blank by the Republican Party. A. Ban control. B. Power politics. C. Veto power. And D. Denial plot. Ang tamang sagot ay letter B, power politics. 30. The only Southeast Asian country never colonized by European power is A. Thailand, B. Korea, C. Malaysia, D. Japan. The answer is Thailand. Okay, so Thailand was the only country in the Southeast Asia that was never colonized by the Europeans. 31. The lightning war that Hitler introduced in the World War II is called A. Skarnhorst, B. Lebensraum, 
C. Blitzkrieg. And D. The Greatest War. The answer is letter C. Blitzkrieg. Okay? It is a German word meaning lightning war. 32. According to anthropologists, from whom should change of practice come? A. From within a culture. B. From outside a culture. C. From religious leaders. And D. From educational leaders. Ang tamang sagot ay letter A. From within a culture. 33. Who was the who was one of the earliest Greek statesmen whose laws gave all classes of citizens some voice in the government? A. Pericles B. Alexander C. Solon D. King Philip Ang tamang sagot ay letter C. Solon 34. Which constitutional safeguard exists such that the executive can turn down legislative measures and Congress can move to remove the president? A. Check and balance. B. Boycott. C. Veto power. D. Welfare state. The answer is A. Check and balance. 35. Which Privilege gives any person in the Philippines to be bodily presented in court for charges of a crime for which he has right of counsel and trial. A. Ex post facto law. B. Writ of habeas corpus. C. Fourth Amendment. And D. Writ of habeas data. The answer is letter B. Writ of of habeas corpus translated this habeas uh, the word habeas corpus translated from the latin it means uh, show me the body okay bodily presented uh, 36 during the hispanic era who can directly check abuses of the government governor general and cause immediate punishment of corrupt spanish officials a visitor or investigating officer B. Viceroy of Mexico, C. Spanish Friars, and D. Royal Audiencia. The answer is letter A. Okay, Visitor or the Investigating Officer. 37. The tribute was a symbol of vassalage by families and unmarried native Filipinos. Who in the beginning paid reals, equivalent to blank in money or in kind? A. 50 pesos. B. 1 peso. C. 100 pesos. D. 10 pesos. The answer here is letter B. 1 peso. 38. Where was the starting point of Western civilization? A. Egypt, B. Mesopotamia, C. India, and D. Africa. The answer is letter B. Mesopotamia, okay, wherein uh, civilization fear, uh, first appeared. 39. What is used as the basis so that scientific theory can be empirical and not merely speculative or opinionated? A. Evidence base. B. Authority. C. Tradition. D. Logical reason. Ang sagot ay letter A. Evidence base. Pag sinabi natin empirical, it is evidence base. 40. What is the fundamental basis for data gathered in the sciences of sociology, biology, and physics? A. Belief. B. Observation. C. Logic. And D. Wisdom. Ang tamang sagot ay letter B. Observation. 41. Which is arrived at by way of a thinking process that puts together several parts to form a complex whole? A. Observation. B. Relationship. C. Synthesis. And D. Analysis. Ang tamang sagot ay letter C. Synthesis. Okay. 42. Which system is applied for careful 
deliberate and quantifiable observation of evidence in order to describe an object or event in terms of indicators. A. Examination. B. Measurement. C. Construction. D. Introspection. Ang tamang sagot is measurement. 43. Social theories can be arrived at base on blank pattern of behavior. A. Diffuse. B. Unified. C. Aggregate. And D. Separate. The answer is letter C. Aggregate. 44. You want to examine specific subpopulations. Which has those who played part in the EDSA revolution with focus on how their attitudes have changed? Which study will you do? A. Longitudinal study, B. Trend study, C. Cohort study, and D. Cross sectional study. The answer is cohort study. 45. What is the appropriate research method? in a field study on a cultural group. Example, a way of life of Bajaos who have settled inland in Zamboanga province. A. Documentary research. B. Open-ended interviews. C. Standardized survey. And D. Ethnographic observation. The answer is letter D. Ethnographic observation. 46. Research leader Edna insisted that students' researchers appreciate the value of blank data or evidence for scientific study above mere speculation or opinion. A. Authority. B. Empirical. C. Tradition. D. Logical reasoning. The answer is empirical. Empirical evidence. Okay. Research base. 47. The earlier period of which we have no written evidence of written records, such as letters, contracts, accounts, etc., that comprise people's literature is technically known as A. Prehistoric, B. Primordial, C. Pristine, and D. Predated. The answer is letter A. Prehistoric. Okay, wala pa tayong written evidence. Okay, number 48. The greatest contribution of the Phoenicians, Phoenicians to the progress of the ancient world was their adoption of blank. A. Alphabet. B. Mercenary soldiers. C. Expert shipbuilders. D. Skillful craftsmen. The answer is letter A. Alphabet. Phoenicians. The great, their greatest contribution was the alphabet. 49. While ancient Egypt maintained medical schools for practice of medicine, surgery treatment was not always scientific because this used blank and magical arts. A. Ointments. B. Herbs. C. Charms. D. Drugs. The answer is letter C. Charms. 50. The last question. Results winning poem, which is considered a classic in the Philippine literature. What is the title of the poem? A. To the Filipino Youth. B. El Amor Parcho. C. Los Viajes. D. The Tales. The answer is letter A. To the Filipino, Filipino Youth. Okay? So thank you so much for listening. I hope that you will play this video again and again so you will be familiarized with all the questions in inside this video. So my next upload will be the TOS, okay, or the table of specifications for the upcoming LET examinations, okay? So thank you so much for watching. Please share this video to your friends so that we can help more um, LET takers, okay? So God bless us all and good evening once again.